Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Dear viewers, uh, most of the time a question is asked that if army takes salary, so if they fight a war, is it jihad? It is 100% jihad. Because if the army would not take the salary, how their household expenses be managed? Because they are on duty for all the times. They are taking salary of their time that they are giving, they are devoting for the country. As we are doing the job, they are also on job. And we are taking the salary. We are taking salary of the duty hours that we are giving, of our time that we are giving to the institution, uh, to the factory, to the bank. The same case is here. And suppose if there is no war for the decades. So remember that army has to be keep themselves ready for all the time. They have to make the mock drills, mock exercises. They have to fight the mock wars for all the time. So that they may show to the uh, opponents, to the enemies, that we are ready for all the time. Remember that I give the proof from uh, Islam that Hazrat Umar Zalakaran, when he sent the companions of the Holy Prophet, the Sahaba Karam, to the border for the protection, he fixed the scholarship for them and for their family so that they may perform their duty with quite easy mind, with quite peaceful mind. In the same way, the Imam of the uh, mosque and the person calling for prayer, Muazzin, and the Qari, and who, who, uh, who teach the Holy Quran, if we will not give them proper salary, how their expenses be managed? No one knows. And secondly, only war is not the issue because every country to, must for every country to be ready for all the time for the war. So army is taking the responsibility. It is the job of the army. So army keeps himself ready for all the time for the war. Army persons can do nothing else except the job. So whether they, there is a war or not, they are on jihad. Whether it is fight or not, they are on jihad. Whether they are at border or in the city, it is jihad. In the same way, if the policemen, they are fighting against the thieves and the looters, it is also the jihad. And if they are killed, it is shahadat. They are martyred. And in the end, I would say that if we are fighting against the thieves and the robbers and we are killed while we are protecting our life and our property, it is also shahadat. So whether army is taking salary, even then it is jihad because their whole time is devoted for the protection of the country. And only because of army, we are feeling that we are totally safe. Thank you so much. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.